proof by induction. Nice, straightforward divisibility proof. So step one, we want to prove it for case, um, the first case. Um, well, it's not actually clear do you start at zero or one. I think for the leave insert, the definition of the natural numbers is to start at one. So case n equals one. So can you divide 12? Is 12 can it be divided into 13 power one minus one? That is, can 12 be divided into 12? But that's obviously true. Step two, assume case n equals k is true. So that is, uh, you can divide 12 into 13 power k minus 1. Step 3, we're required to prove case n equals k plus 1 is true. So we want to prove that 12 can be divided into 13 power k min uh, plus 1 minus 1. Well, that's equal to 12, and then that 13 power k plus 1 can be changed into 13 times 13k minus 1. And that 13 can be changed into 12 plus 1 times 13 power k minus 1. And that can be expanded. So can 12 be divided into 12 times 13 power k plus and then 1 times 13. So 13 power k minus 1. Or that is can 12 well, I'll just make it ex very explicit here. Can 12 be divided into 12 times 13 power k plus 13 power k minus 1? But this one here, this one here is clearly true. Obviously, you can divide 12 into 12 times 13 power k because this is a multiple of 12. And this one here is true from um, step 2. The assumption in step two. So that ends the proof. Well, the conclusion is step one plus step two plus step three implies it's true for um, n equals one, n equals two, n equals three, etc. So basically for all the natural numbers. And um, that is question four A.